<laughs> what other weird things are you into? Uh, like ancient Egyptian stuff. Uh, I'm trying to figure out how they build the pyramids. Nobody figured out yet. I'm big on finding gold. Have you watched Oak Island, The Curse of Oak Island? No. Yeah, watch that on uh, History Channel. It comes on every Tuesday at 9 o'clock Eastern Time. You got to watch Thank it. They're on, they're on season 8. I mean, they're trying to find the gold under the, 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 the templates, the Knights Templars. Basketball questions. Come on. <laughs> There you go. Uh, 183 pointers already this season. You've already set your career best for most reason made in a, in a season. How, how good does that feel, and where do you see this going this season? You know, man, it's, you know, nothing from us in the league, but like, just like I said earlier, I'm just thank God for being blessed, you know, to be in this position, you know, and uh, you know, a lot of a lot of guys, a lot of shooters, you know, I don't really, I don't really get this mark, but uh, I'm just blessed to be here, and uh, thank God every minute. Allowed me. I put a lot of work in, you know, and uh, especially last summer, and uh, me and my trainer, we put a ton of work in, and uh, you know that's one of you know that's one of my biggest strengths. And, uh, and all I say is, once I get more talent, time on the court, I will be able to showcase what I can do. And uh, you know, in this season, uh, you know, David was able to give me more time, and uh, I was able to showcase what I can do and how effective I can be on the court. It sounds kind of silly. Though. Every shot you take, do you just think it's going in? Facts, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, like, even the ones I missed, and, like, the first two to start the game off, I was like, man, y'all y'all boys lucky I let you off the hook because they felt good, but I just shorted just a little bit. But uh, but I was able to get a few down going, get myself rolling. But uh, with every shot I feel like I'm shooting, you know, uh, I feel like it doesn't go in. But, uh, even if it comes off wrong, I, you know, I already know uh, – I want to miss that. So uh, just a feel, man. I've been shooting the ball all my life, and I mean, guys, tell you I'm out in the gym, putting in extra hours uh, to, to perfect my shot. And uh, there's a lot of great shooters in the league, you know. And, uh, and, I, and I watch them around here, and uh, I'm just competing, man, to be the one, one of the best shooters in the league, and probably one of the best shooters to ever play this game. It's one thing we see when guys go up against teams that are bigger than you, but when they try to be physical to you and use that to their strengths. You guys seem to kind of come out on the other side pretty well in that regard. How does that happen? Yeah, because, uh, you know, you, you got to compete, man. It's all about competing and uh, having fun, man. You know, Joe Hurl is a – he's a handful down there. You know, he's an all-star, and uh, he do, he does what he does very well at a high level. And uh, it's hard to contain. You know, you got to a lot of bodies. You got to show Willie. You got to show Harry. You got to show Marvin. You got to double team him, you know. You got to make him work for, you know, for what he wants. And uh, he's special, you know. And same thing with Ben. And Jimmy, you know, they have three strong guys on the perimeter and uh, inside. So, uh, man, it's a tough matchup, man. And, uh, I see why I think a lot of people, a lot of team held in the league. Buddy, three-point shooting has been good all year. It's, tonight, it's, been, it's been okay. But you, tonight you got to the rack a couple of times with other big dunks. And yeah. Aaron was saying he's been encouraging you to do that more right. and more. He lied. <laughs> <laughs> nah, Are that's you what trying do. to make that more of an emphasis to get to the rack a couple of times? And, and how does that change things, not just for you, but for the entire offense when you're doing it? I just think that, uh, you know, just getting easy ones to get myself going and, uh, and just keeping the defense honest. The defense honest, that's uh, moving around the three-point line and, uh, also the mid-range shot, you know, uh, trying to make that too, and uh, just you know, keep defense thinking, and uh, they don't know what I want to do, and uh, they run me off the line, just trying to make them play in certain areas on the court. I think obviously you're having your individual success, but everybody who played tonight scored, put up points. What does that do for the culture of the locker room? Oh, it is great. You know, it's a it's a good vibe. You know, especially a good team like that, and uh, you know, we all know what mistakes we have. You know, we, we're catching. You know, we're trying to get in the playoff contention, and. Uh, and the rest is extremely tough, as you see. You know, we're being the East, we probably be in the fifth, sixth seed. But uh, just the fun being in the West, and uh, and uh, we're a young team, but uh, we're competitive, and uh, we're not going to let go, man. We're not going to hold back, and uh, we're going to keep fighting and uh, proving daughters wrong. Are you guys talking playoffs right now? What do you think? You think we're not going to be talking playoffs? You know, you think we want to go home in early April? Is it, is, it a, is it a real discussion amongst you? Guys? I, I, it has to be, man. What are we playing for? You know, we, the franchise put us out here to. Uh, to produce, you know, they want to get the playoff. The city want to get the playoff. You know, they haven't been in a long time, so uh, that's all our goal to get the playoff. There's no question. Every team in the NBA is trying to get there, and uh, you know, and uh, everybody's still doubting us, but uh, we believe in ourselves, and uh, we're gonna keep on believing and uh, keep having faith in what we got going on. You were going well at your position, obviously, but that last rebound when there's three Sixers around you, were you pretty surprised to see who was standing around you and you come away with the ball? I didn't know who's around me. I was just trying to get the ball. All I know, they followed me afterwards, but. Uh, it was cool, man. You know, uh, Dave said we could help reap the bigs rebound a lot. 
and he's been preaching all year, you know, trying to get inside to help with the bigs. You know, sometimes they get mad at me for not even rebounding. So, uh, you know, that was big for us. That rebound was a security, security game. But, uh, man, that's trying to help out as much as I can, man.